You can barely turn this thing. As long as I fly over them, that should be fine, right? Except I don't know if the engine can hold that long. Takedown is authorized. Change bearing or we will engage. I don't think you understand the effort I've gone to be here, pal. I mean, now there wouldn't be that many giant ground cabbages, really. But so, pretty, uh, pretty out now. Before. And then I'm like, how could they release this game? The exact same happened this time. Can I get a haircut at this time of the night? Looks good. Yes, yeah, bad room. Now I'm telling you, if you don't sleep in that hair net, you're gonna wake up with your brains in your pillow, dig? All right, I hear you. See ya. Come on in, honey. Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God. The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Oh, good idea. But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask, are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. What do you have in mind? Can you get a mullet? Yeah, I start. Ooh, ooh. 
a bullet. It's fine. Yep. Thanks for stopping by. Just needs a cap now. Holy shit! What? He's dead, yeah. B, what is that? B, who is... This? I guess so. Want to create your own architecture pattern to annoy people who use MVC and M Y M B V M. I don't, but I want to. Oh, well, I don't even know what they they are. Those two. Oh, nice place you got here. Oh yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it? Huh? Cheap and fucking easy. <laughs> But uh, this, this here is my place, and my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get a point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. I got news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off. Listen. I'm sorry. But we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism. Uh, he just did. Gas, I pulled this mission. Terror. Thank God I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. Boat, tandem rotor heavy lift helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. And my psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made, honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. Sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we got to go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Yeah, Michael getting mad bye or bye. heated, yeah. Ah, oh, Jesus. All right. I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on. You're driving us up to the bank. The bank? 
How much was staying low, huh? Categorization, but then what? Think about it. Where you live, Sandy Shores, you precious ass. Sorry, there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right, but why are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America, and real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jason, what, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, D. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoo. The hair. The weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs. It's gonna be never no monkey. Stop everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. Well, I'll be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers. You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up. Then the skinny lattes. And then the bankers and you'll be somewhere else starting the cycle all over again maybe you're not a classic garden variety hipster but you're what the hipsters aspire to be the bus stops up here all right how long does it take us to get out here from ls a day Come on, man, knock it off. What? Yeah. I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Whoa. 